Ask the Experts, sponsored by St. Elizabeth Healthcare. All right, local women's health providers getting some high-tech help in the operating room. Liz Bonas here with How It Is Improving Lives. Liz. Hey guys, good afternoon to you once again. Urogynecology experts at St. Elizabeth Healthcare in Fort Thomas today spent some time with us for a special Facebook Live event. We asked them to share how robotics help to treat what are commonly called pelvic floor disorders. It's a common condition, affects up to 30% of all women. And what happens is you leak when you cough, sneeze, laugh sometimes. Sometimes women feel that things are falling out, including the bladder, the uterus, and sometimes the rectum. When that happens, the average patient, according to Dr. Sonali Rahman, waits seven years to get help. I needed to have repair done, and so I, it was something I put off for years. But not anymore. Ginny Van Cleve had a procedure to repair her pelvic floor with the help of this robot known as the Da Vinci XI. And the robot does not move unless I'm moving it. It is not its own kind of freestanding. It's an extension of your That's arms right. and your abilities. That's so right. you can do a pelvic floor, you can fix a bladder leakage, you can do a hysterectomy. What's kind of the... You know, the main thing is kind of giving support to that vaginal prolapse. Dr. Raman sits at this console to repair a problem such as a vaginal prolapse. Her fingers can be placed in these white loopholes. She can then see on a monitor inside it what she is repairing. While the robot's arms work to do sort of what her own arms are doing, she has the help of surgical assistance. Dr. Raman, I'm going to remove your arm one. She can then perform the operation through tiny incisions. For those who are part of the team, is I get to do the fun, the fun part of actually doing the procedure. It's amazing on a weekly basis how many people we really do see and the lives that we're changing. Boy, they do an amazing mm. job. You know, nobody wants to talk about that. That mm -hmm. was why I was so grateful our patient and everybody would. Yeah. If you'd like to make an appointment, we do have a phone number for you. It's 859-757-2132. Or check out the full Facebook Live on my Liz Bonus page or our Local 12 page. You know, you can have a kind of confidential conversation yeah. on Facebook. Yeah. It's just the intimacy of the operating room <laughs> and your living room, and you can watch it wherever you're comfortable. And lots of times people say they don't, ch they don't tell their children, they don't tell really? their spouses. Because you're so embarrassed. Oh, mm -hmm. but, you know, it's just a part of life. Life. Everyone gets something, and you need to be open about it because it Well, helps. and what's more is if you have something that can be fixed. Right, right, the, right. She I said mean, the average person waits seven years before oh, they get Oh, and I, I mean, I don't mean to judge if you don't talk about it, yeah. but I think it's so healthy when people can, and it, it helps everybody. I think them talking about it to us. Yeah, thank <laughs> you. Really, really yeah. Start the conversation. Okay. Yeah.